Hello, and welcome to Inyo Pool's How-To Guide section. In this video, we're going to talk about how a multi-port valve operates. There are three major types of pool filtering systems. Cartridge, sand, and DE. Sand and DE filters use a multi-port valve primarily to help clean or back flush the filter media. Cartridge filters do not have multi-port valves. These filters are cleaned by removing the cartridge and spraying it with a garden hose. A typical multi-port valve has seven settings. Filter, backwash, rinse, waste, closed, recirculate, and winter. This guide explains the function of these settings and shows how they circulate water in a typical sand filter. The operation of a DE multi-port valve is very similar. There are five ports, into and out of a typical multi-port valve. The top port, labeled pump, brings unfiltered water in from the pump. The middle port, labeled return, sends filtered water back to the pool. The middle right port, labeled waste, sends water to an external drain hose. The other two ports control flow through the filter. At the bottom of the valve, a piping port connects to the collection tubes on the bottom of the filter. The area around the pipe on the bottom side of the valve directs water to the top of the filter. The next series of steps explains how each of the valve settings directs water through these ports. Caution! When selecting a valve setting, make sure that the pump has been turned off and always depress the handle before turning. Filter. This is the normal setting for filtering your pool water and for regular vacuuming. Water from the pool is pumped into the pump port to the top of the filter. Contaminants are removed as the water makes its way to the bottom to be pushed back up through a central pipe to the return port and back to the pool. Backwash. After a period of time, the contaminants start to clog the sand to the point where water flow is significantly diminished and the pressure gauge rises 8 to 10 psi above normal operation ratings. To clean out the contaminants, you have to backwash the sand. In the backwash setting, water flow is reversed through the filter. Water comes from the pump port down the filter through the central pipe then back up through the sand to flow out the top exit of the filter and out the waste port to an external drain. As the water flows up through the sand, the sand is lifted about seven inches above its normal height, releasing the trapped contaminants to be purged out in the wastewater. Rinse. After backwashing, the sand is loose and needs to be reset. Also, any dirty water from backwashing has to be rinsed out of the filter to waste to prevent it from returning to the pool. With the valve in rinse mode, water is directed from the pump port to the top of the tank to compress the sand. As in the filter setting, the water flows down through the sand and back up through the central pipe, but instead of going out the return port to the pool, the water is diverted out the waste port. Waste. This setting is used to bypass the filter when you want to vacuum the pool after an algae treatment. It also lowers the pool level. The water enters the valve through the pump port and exits through the waste port. Closed. This setting is used for shutting off all flow to the filter and pool. Water flow is stopped at the pump port. Recirculate. The setting is used to bypass the filter during certain pool cleanups and chemical treatments when you don't want the water contaminating the sand. Water enters the valve through the pump port and exits back to the pool through the return port. Winter. Use this setting when you are closing down the pool for the winter. This will allow water to drain from the valve. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to call us toll free at 1-877-372-6038 or visit us online at www.nyopools.com.